So now let's take up the next question. Here we have question number 29 on the board, which says two convex lenses A and B, each of focal length 30 centimeter are separated by 30 centimeter as shown in the figure. An object O is placed at a distance of 40 centimeter to the left of lens A, as you can clearly see here in this figure. So this object O is placed at a distance of 40 centimeter from this lens A and this is lens B. Lens A and lens B are separated by a distance of 30 centimeter. This is what is given to us in the question. Now what we need to find out? Let us read the question further. The further question says what is the distance of the final image formed by this lens system? Obviously students here first lens A is going to form the image of this object and then that image is going to act as an object for lens B and final image will be formed by lens B. So now let us quickly solve this question. So to solve this question what I am going to do? I need to apply lens formula. So from the lens formula I can write 1 by f is equal to 1 by v minus 1 by u. Okay, for lens A, first I will solve it for lens A. First I need to find out the distance of image formed by lens A. So let us quickly find out that. So for lens A, when I will apply this lens formula, what I am going to get? See here. The focal length of both the lenses are 30 centimeter. So here I will write this as 30. Now this is plus 30 because here in the question convex lenses are given to us. What is the object distance? Object is placed at a distance of 40 centimeter and we know object distance is negative. So it will be negative. So on calculation this 1 by v come out to be 1 by 120 and this implies that V that is image of the object formed by lens A and hence I am going to write down here as VA that is the image of the object formed by lens A and it will form the image at a distance of 120 centimeter. Let us mark it. Now have a look at the question again. See. This lens A will form the image of the object at a distance of 120 centimeter. But what is going to be the object distance for lens B? Obviously, there is this 30 centimeter. So, if I roughly say that the image of object will be formed somewhere here. Let us suppose I say it is formed here. This is the image of the object formed by lens A and this complete distance that is this distance is given to us. We have calculated it actually and that comes out to be 120 centimeter. So what is the object distance for lens B? It will be 120 minus 30 that is 90 centimeter. So for this lens B the object distance is not 120 centimeter it is 90 centimeter. So here we have this distance as the object distance for lens B. Now let us try to find out V. Now what I am going to do is I will again apply lens formula but this time I am going to apply this for lens B. So I can write it here for lens B. What I can write down? Again I will write the same formula that is lens formula 1 by f is equal to 1 by v minus 1 by u. Now for lens b what is the focal length? It is 30. Again this will be plus 30 because convex lens is there. 1 by vb 
that is the final image actually minus 1 by 90. Now here I have not substituted the negative sign here because this object distance as you can see it here. This distance is being measured in the direction of the incident light. So, this time it will be positive. So, on substituting the values this 1 by Vb will come out to be 1 by 30 plus 1 by 90 on taking the LCM I will have this as 90 in the numerator it will be 3 plus 1 that is 4 by 90. On calculating this this Vb that is the final image will come out to be 90 by 4 that is 22.5 centimeter. So, the final image Vb will be formed at a distance of 22.5 centimeter and that too from lens B and on which side it is going to lie? It will lie on the right side of lens B. So, see here if we have a look at the options we know option 3 is the correct option. So, let us mark it I am going to write it here for you as well answer of this question is option 3. I hope students this question is very clear to you. Now, let us move on to the next question.